Hello, Bill here, Pale Horse Survival and Tactical. Today we're going to take a look at the Burr Oak. This is what we have in front of us here. These are rather large oak trees. They have a pretty wide spreading canopy. And we'll go ahead and get a little closer, take a look at the leaves. The canopy on these oaks spread really wide. These oak trees have rather large leaves. Quercus is the genus that all oaks fall into. And there are two classifications of oaks. There's white oaks and red oaks. And uh, this is a white oak. And the easiest way to tell that, the lobes on the leaves are rounded. Red oaks have uh, pointed lobes. These are all rounded. Easiest way to tell if you're ever trying to identify an oak tree and trying to narrow it down. The nice thing about a bur oak, it's spelled B U R, uh, B U double R with two R's. Uh, bur oaks have some of the largest acorns out of all the oak trees. Uh, another name for this oak is a uh, mossy cup oak due to the uh, the mossy look of the uh, acorn cap here. And those are huge acorns. If you're collecting acorns and uh, going to process them for a uh, for a food source, uh, it doesn't take too many of these. They add up pretty fast. These I harvested a while back. They're getting pretty dry, and I'm going to do a video on processing uh, the uh, acorns and uh, leaching the tannins out. Now, one general rule with acorns is the larger the cap, the higher the tannin content. The smaller the cap, the uh, lower the tan tannin content. So these are going to have pretty high tannin uh, content, but I'm going to show uh, in the video that I'll, I'll do here pretty soon. I'm going to demonstrate how to do a very simple method of cold leaching and cold leaching uh, preserves all the uh, valuable acorn oil it's where you get a lot of the nutrients and calories and uh, valuable fats in a survival situation anyways this is uh, the burr oak a close up of the bark here And the botanical name is Quercus macrocarpa. For those of you who are interested in the uh, botanicals, please like, subscribe, and share. And uh, as always, I will see you very soon on the next one. Everybody have a great day. Take care. Bye-bye.